Hi, my name is Hannah Choi, and I'm a student in Music 258. Um, this is an instrument I've created for the course, and it is called the cello net. The cello net is an electronic hybrid instrument combining string and wind instrument interfaces, specifically the cello and the clarinet. It was very much inspired by my own instrumental background as a cellist. As you can see, the cello net is primarily composed of a fingerboard, a mouthpiece, strings, and on and off buttons. To briefly go over the, um, the process of making the fingerboard, um, it was created through a laser cutting a trapezoidal shape from acrylic, then using a heat gun to give it its curved shape, and after I spray painted it black. To play the cello net, you must first turn the instrument on by pressing the white button. Then, to generate sound, you can blow into the mouthpiece, like so. The mouthpiece is connected to an air pressure sensor and through the sensor you can control whether the instrument produces sound, um, the gain, as well as the vibrato gain. So greater intensity when blowing into the instrument will cause an increase in gain and a faster and tighter vibrato. The function of the mouthpiece can be seen as equivalent to that of a bow. Now, to generate a tune, um, one can use the strings, which are extended soft popped membrane potentiometers, 500 millimeters long. Um, these sensors are great because they allow for continuous control of pitch and the expressive qualities of um, a string instrument, like sliding, and um, which is known as glissandi, as well as the ability to vary the vibrato distance. Um, and so for these two sensors or strings, really, um, I've modeled them off of the upper two strings of an actual cello, which are the A and D strings. And to give the strings notes and continuity, I assigned sensor values to frequencies. Um, the cello net comes with two modes, two instru instrumental modes, which are the clarinet and cello modes for sound. And one can select the mode by toggling the white button. And to turn the instrument off, you press the black button. All right. Um, now, to play the instrument, you have two options. You can stand up like a clarinetist, and um, this is a little bit unstable, but it gives you the gestural freedom of a clarinetist to kind of move around. Um, another option is to sit down like so, to put it on your lap um, and blow into the piece. And this allows your arms to be more free and the instrument becomes more stable. Lastly, I will provide you with a short demo of the cello net. <laughs> 